Using a laparoscopy procedure, your physician will be able to view your internal organs and even operate by using an optical device inserted through a small incision in your abdomen. We will now see a laparoscopy examination similar to what you will have. There are various ways to perform the procedure your surgeon will explain any differences to you. A needle will probably be placed in a vein. With only this one needle puncture, you can receive the necessary medications and fluids. If you have chosen to have the examination using local anesthesia, such as this patient, you will be aware of your surroundings or you could have it performed using general anesthesia, so you will be asleep. You may then have various instruments placed to take your blood pressure and pulse. Your legs will be placed in stirrups. Your doctor and his assistants will now prepare so the procedure will be performed in a sterile manner. The abdomen will then be cleaned with a surgical soap. Next, your vagina will be cleaned. Your bladder may be emptied if your doctor thinks it necessary. An instrument will be placed to later move the uterus during the examination. If you have chosen to have local anesthesia, you will feel a needle as the anesthetic is injected. This will numb the skin so you do not feel discomfort as the rest of the procedure is performed. You can see this patient is able to talk to her doctor and does not feel any discomfort. Some doctors choose to make a small incision in the umbilicus. This is because the abdominal wall is very thin and easy to puncture at this location. A small needle is inserted and gas is allowed to flow into your abdominal cavity. This takes a few minutes. If you are awake, you may experience fullness in your abdomen at this time. This lasts only a short period of time. The laparoscope has been inserted and the doctor is viewing and manipulating a tube. If you are having a sterilization procedure, the tubes will be closed at the location of the arrows. Here you can see a tube that has been sealed and cut 
using an electric current. The white organ is an ovary and above it is a fallopian tube. The uterus is in the middle. All the pelvic organs are being examined. Here you see fibroids on the back of the uterus. You also see an ovarian cyst being measured. Adhesions have grown to the back of the uterus. The rest of your abdominal cavity can also be examined. The appendix is easily viewed. And also the liver and gallbladder. The white sac to your left is the gallbladder. You can see here adhesions to the liver. Now the doctor is lifting the liver to examine the undersurface. You have seen many of the organs your doctor will see when he does your procedure. He may be performing laparoscopy to help make a diagnosis or to operate. Before laparoscopy, a large incision had to be used to perform this examination. Now you will be able to resume your activities much quicker than was previously possible.